All right, pretty self-explanatory. Open, if you have a file saved in there that you want to print, save. The settings are all date and time for the nozzle. Adjust your language. Clearly I'm in English. See if there are any updates. You want to diagnose the unit if you're having any issues. Haven't set the date and time yet, so that is clearly going to be incorrect. That's 2020. 11. Sorry, I'm part off the screen here. 17. Um, I'm not even really sure what time it is. I think it's about noon. Let's go with that. That's good enough. So, say you want to edit this to say Joe's Plumbing or something, whatever. Highlight, edit. You can adjust the size, the width, whether you want the font bolded or not. Enter in the space. Backspace. Let's see, yep. this is the first time using it. Let's see where the apostrophe is. Oops, hit the wrong button. See over here. Nope. Over here. And the apostrophe is right there. Okay. Well, as you can see, it takes a little getting used to. Truth up there, starts again. Hit this button to get back to lettering. Too many spaces. Touch screen is very sensitive, which is a good thing. There we go. Now let's go through the adjustments, how I want it to print. If I don't want that size, I could go 10 instead. Well, that is clearly too small, so we'll go to 100. That'd be just about right. Maybe we'd go to 80. Yeah, place it where you want. Yeah, there's not really much to it. Not ready to.